everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to a vlog. So today is Friday, Friday the 10th of February and I'm just about to leave the house because I'm off to the Cotswolds for the weekend. So this is kind of like Tom and I's Valentine's Day weekend. Um, we're celebrating it this weekend which will be lovely, we've got a really cute airbnb in the cotswolds you guys know how much i love the cotswolds so i'm so excited i'm packed um you would have seen the pack with me that went up on my channel sunday uh this vlog is going up on the wednesday so it was the weekend just gone that i've been away and i'm really looking forward to it i am gonna leave now it's one o'clock and it's gonna take me just over an hour to get there but i have got um quite a few errands to run and a few things to sort out lots of your vintage parcels to send so obviously i'm going to do that first and then head over to kingham is where we're staying um it's a really really cute airbnb been to kingham quite a few times before they have the wild rabbit there and the kingham plow which i've been to and i think our airbnb is like a 30 minute walk from dalesford so super good location i will leave it linked down below in case you guys want to stay there but yeah i'm excited i'm going to get there before tom i'm meeting him there um so i should get there probably about half past three and I think he's going to get there probably about an hour after me. So it'd be quite nice to have the place myself for a bit. I can give you a proper tour of it. That's the plan for the weekend. And I thought we would vlog it because it would be quite fun. This is my first proper vlog. Just me and Tom. So I'm not sure how he's going to be on the camera. But we'll see. <laughs> So I have literally just walked in. All my stuff right by the door. And I thought that I would give you guys a little first impressions. So this is the sitting room. Where are the lights? Here they are. Oh, there we go. How cute. Lovely little sofa. They've got my book. Eat, drink, nap. The Soho Home one. We've got a wood burner as well, which I'm so excited about. I love that instead of doors, they have these little curtain rails everywhere. And then in here is the kitchen. Very nice, put the lights on in here as well. Lovely. Oh, they've left us a teapot and biscuits. Milk, chocolate and coconut, I don't like coconut, but that is so cute. Fresh milk, that's always good. There's a lovely little outside area as well which would be so cute to set up if it's nice and warm. But how adorable is this space? Nice table for us to sit and eat at as well. So lovely. And then upstairs, let's have a look at the bedrooms. I think there's two bedrooms. Obviously we don't need two bedrooms. Bathroom is in here. Lovely, got cow shed products. Making a little dishevelled after my drive, but I made it in really good time actually. Nice big shower, bath as well. How interesting. And then I'm guessing these are the two bedrooms. Oh, that's cute. Oh my goodness, robes as well. Oh, a lovely touch. And then this bedroom the light on again oh how lovely is that bed gorgeous oh my god and two more robes yeah this is such a lovely place it would be so nice to come like as a four or for a family or something turn all these lights off i don't want to leave them on but yeah i'm gonna unpack the food supplies that i got for dinner put the wine in the fridge and that sort of stuff um and get everything ready for Tom to arrive, so it's all nice for him. I would try and put the wood burner on, but I don't think I'll be very good at it. And I know he'll probably want to do that, so I'll leave that for now. But um, how lovely. This is gorgeous. Obviously, I'll leave the link to this Airbnb down below so you guys can have a look at it if you want. But I love it so far. I love it, love it, love it. Listen to me, go closer. Where will I go? I feel like a puppet elf in the start of the film. Really? 
vệ sinh hoài tự hộ nha Hello everyone, so we are back now at the Airbnb, we've got the fire going, I'll show you. So lovely, we've got a glass of rosé each um, and we are just about to make some of my infamous salmon tacos. I don't think I've shared this on my channel before but I do make some good salmon tacos so I bought all the stuff earlier and I brought it here with me because I thought that we were probably going to cook tonight. Um, we've obviously had some oysters that you've seen at the local pub, which was the King and Plough. I'll leave a link to that in the description box, but now we're going to cook some proper dinner, maybe watch some TV, maybe play some board games, but that is the plan. made salmon tacos and they're okay but I forgot the feta so they're not as good as they normally are. Tom's not very happy with his because he put so much hot sauce on the first one so he's had to get a second. Fire's going good though and we've got goggle box on. Good morning everyone it is Saturday morning it's 10 o'clock, um, so we've had a very nice lie-in. Just about to do my skincare. Um, my Elemis cream here, and I thought I would chat to you guys about the plan for the day. I'm loving these robes. Such a nice little touch for an Airbnb. Um, so yeah, we've had a nice lazy morning, a lovely lie-in. I'm gonna go for a walk. I think Tom, I think, is gonna run. I will definitely not be doing that. Um, go for a little walk around Kingham, see the countryside a little bit, because when we got here yesterday, it kind of got dark pretty much straight away. So have a little wander around this gorgeous little green um, up here. And then go to the shop, I think get some food supplies, make ourselves a little brunch here. Um, and then, wander down to the wild rabbit so last night we ended up going to the king and plow which you guys will have seen tom fancied some oysters and they had oysters there so we went down there for some rosé and a little cocktail and had some oysters and had some white bait as well and then came back and cooked the um fish tacos that i'd got previously so we had them for our dinner watched some tv went to bed and yeah so we're going to try the wild rabbit today we haven't booked anything and i know it gets so booked up but it does say in the guest book here that you can like walk in and maybe get like a seat at the bar so that's what we're going to try um and then this evening we've got dinner at the feathered nest inn which should be lovely tom's just so made cool. me so an egg royale for breakfast friends on and I've got the fire going but I think I may have put too many logs on it um, yeah, maybe it'll be all right <laughs> I'm not gonna get your shoes in it be camera shy <laughs> <laughs> We've come on a walk. Not sure where we're going. <laughs> oh, you're, I you're so awkward. It's so I sweet. I don't want to be on the camera. I know you don't. You're not. It's just me. Don't worry. Do I don't know there? if there's a, a footpath up here, though. There is. Oh, That's gorgeous. That would be lovely. It's just a little extension. Yeah. It's a lovely little village. You just had a See, down here, down here. swing on the... Uh, that's not a footpath, I don't think, babe. Access. No, it's not. 
Hmm. Um, what, we think it's a No, because it's a private farm, I think. Right. Mission. Find the football. Right, we're just leaving out for dinner and I thought that I would get Tom to film me so you can see my outfit a bit better. Jacket is Zara and this is the black bodysuit that I always wear. And then I got this skirt from River Island and I spoke about it in my pack with me video. But it's just like a nice long midi skirt and they also do it in cream as well. And then I've got my mango sock boots on and my bag and we're going to a little place called the Feathered Nest Inn. So we're back from dinner now. Um, we've got the fire going again. My handiwork, getting quite good at this now. And Tom bought me this for Valentine's. So I'm gonna have a glass of that. What have you got, Coke? All cozy in my pajamas, fluffy socks, dressing gown. And we're gonna see if there's something on the telly. I know the Brits was on tonight, so that may still be on. Or there might be a film or something we can watch. There's Sky here, but um, it's so old. It has this remote. I haven't seen this Sky remote in goodness knows how long, but um, it's got the old, if I put the TV guide on, the old um, TV guide as well. Such a throwback. So that's our plan for the rest of the evening. Um, we've got Monopoly and Uno as well that I bought with me so we may play a little game. Got this camera. God the focus is driving me insane. Um, we're going to try and get up early in the morning and go for a walk but we may not want to. We may want to have a bit of a lie-in um, and then we're going to go to Dalesford tomorrow which would be nice. Probably have some lunch there before the trip comes to an end. everyone it's Sunday morning and we just checked out of the Airbnb um, very sad to say goodbye actually we did ask for a late checkout but they um, couldn't give it to us because they've got more guests coming today um, we actually kind of outstayed our welcome a bit as well because the cleaners were going in as we were coming out but we're in the car, we're on the way to Diddley Squat Farm Shop because Tom wants to have a look at it and see what it's all about. I said it's not that interesting um, and Jeremy Clarkson won't be there but we're going to go have a little drive up there, see what it's all about and then head to Dalesford and have a look around there and maybe get some lunch. Um, haven't decided yet but it's quite a, a gloomy day which is a bit of a shame. We might go on a walk as well if we can find a nice footpath. We did struggle to find one yesterday, so I'm not sure about that. I'm in the car now, I'm driving my own car, and I am on the way. 
we're home, sadly. Um, we went to Dalesford. We were going to get something to eat, but the menus at Dalesford did not excite us. Um, so we just decided to head off. So Tom has gone back to Bournemouth. Um, I'm obviously heading home. Um, I've got, I think, about another like 40 minutes left of my journey, so not too far. My eyes are so red, it's because I'm really tired. Um, but yeah, we had the most amazing time. I'm not too sure what this vlog is gonna be like. Also, I'm balancing this camera so awkwardly, so I'm really sorry about this wonky angle. But I just wanted to finish the vlog like whilst I'm still on my way home so that um, I don't get home and just forget. But yeah, um, we had the most amazing time. It was such a lovely little break. Thoroughly recommend if you haven't been to the Cotswolds to give it a go. These little bits sticking out of my bun. Um, because it is so lovely, it's so beautiful. You can literally just spend hours walking around all these little villages, um, which is what we were going to do. You can literally just drive and find a little village and walk around. We were gonna go to the Slaughters, Upper Slaughter and Lower Slaughter, but we did decide to call it a day. But yeah, we had the loveliest time. I hope I filmed enough for you guys to get like a nice idea of what we got up to and a good feel for the vlog. Hopefully we will have some more nice vlogs, Tom and I. We do some other fun things together. We were thinking about maybe going to Cornwall actually in a few weeks, so potentially I may vlog that. I'm gonna head home now. I didn't buy anything from Dalesford, can you believe that? Um, I did think about it. I wanted to get maple a little something actually because they normally have really nice dog toys but they didn't have anything that I liked really. Um, so gave that a miss. In the description box, the link to the Airbnb and the places that we went to. We went to the Plough, the Wild Rabbit, obviously Dalesford, the Feather Nest Inn. Um, I'll leave those websites in case you guys want to go. Um, but yeah, we had the most amazing time and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you enjoyed seeing what we got up to. If you did, it would be amazing if you could give it a like. If you're new to my channel, I would love it if you subscribed and I will see you all very soon.